everybody, Sister Fantastic here, and welcome to Face Mask Friday. Yay! So today's vitamin C day, and I know I just used this in my Sunday night skin treats, but I love the results, and so I wanted to go in with this Be Bright Be You Brightening Gold Face Mask from Facetory. It's got vitamin C in it, and it's going to help with purple circles underneath my eyes and, you know, pigmentation on my skin and all those good fun things. So if you have any kind of pigmentation, dark spots, acne scars, purple circles underneath your eyes, a vitamin C mask is going to help you a lot. So anyway, this one is shiny, it's gold, and it's juicy, and it's easy to apply, easy to wear. And so I'm just gonna put this on, and while it sits on my face for a few minutes, I'm going to cut my hair. I'm getting ready to go on a trip and my hair, I've been saying I'm going to cut it for a long time now and it's spring and all this scraggly ends has got to go. So I'm just going to apply this very carefully and I've already got my hair combed out and parted down the middle in the back and I'm going to show you what I do. This is uh, just really easy for me to maintain my hair like this. My hair is fine and it is, it has been thinning out, but the uh, split ends contribute to the breakage and I got to deal with it. So about twice a year, I whack it off really good just to help it along. Okay, I'm just going to rub this in my hands and then we're going to go ahead and get started. I've got quite a bit of hair. So let me show you how long it is. When it hangs down my back, when it's wet, it reaches my waist right now. But anyway, there you go. It's like way out there. And it's incredibly long and it's just, it becomes, as the split ends become more prominent, it becomes increasingly difficult to manage. So I use all kinds of, you know, conditioners and hair masks and, you know, products that help bring moisture to my hair, but just getting rid of the split ends is gonna help with the tangles. And so, there you go, there's that side. So, anyhow, let's get going with this. I got my handy dandy little pair of scissors here. And, uh, and here's a comb. So I'm just gonna show you what I do. I just parted it down the middle in the back and I bring each side forward. And I just cut it dry, I don't have to have it wet. And I try to bring it out here to where my shoulder is. Out here kinda like to the side, you know because I'm figuring the length from the back coming together with the length from the front right here in the middle is gonna land right here, you know, at my shoulders. And so you can see if I cut it up to my shoulders, I'm gonna be cutting quite a bit. So I'm, that's what I'm thinking today. I'm gonna just whack it off and cut it. I'm gonna cut a good three inches. So let me just, I got an envelope here. I'm just going to let the hair fall right there on the envelope. And I'm just going to whack it good. You probably can't see what I'm doing. But I'm trying not to let the hair fall on the floor. And then when it comes back together... in the back. Anyway, you can see here, there's a little piece. It's about four inches long, what I'm cutting off. And these scissors are a little bit on the dull side. I should have got a sharper pair. 
but we're going to manage. It's going to feel so good to have a fresh start. I like doing this a couple times a year because my hair grows pretty fast, but it also breaks because it's dry. The ends especially. So. Just whackety whack whack. Whackety whack whack. I could ask my husband to do this, but he's not here. He went to the store. Okay, so there you see. There is the new length. It's still really long. Shoulder length is not short for me, but when it gets down to where it is, has been here lately, and there's nothing but it looks like scraggly ends, then, you know, I just can't put up with it anymore, especially all the tangles. All right, so let me discard all of that and comb this out make sure I got all the pieces and it looks pretty pretty even so this is probably anybody that's out there that's a hairdresser is probably shaking their head at me <laughs> right now but this is just the way that I do it and it works for me and it saves me trips to the hairdresser and it's just a lot easier than trying to, you know, get somebody else to do it for me. Okay, so now this side and I'm going to try to make sure that it's even. So I kind of like even it up and then I take it out to the side let me try this other pair of scissors here see if it'll work better for me yeah I believe that it might anyway I'll still pull my hair back and ponytails you know but it'll just be a lot healthier than all these scraggly ends All right, let me comb this and see. And because my hair is so fine and so thin, it just cuts really, really easy. I got a couple of little pieces there that need a little more trimming. And now I'm just checking to make sure they're even again. And I got a piece here that's not quite as even with the others. That's what happens. See, I part my hair on the side. And so this part over here is naturally going to be long. If I was to part it in the middle it would, and swing it over, it would be longer. It would show up longer on this side. So, anyway, gotta work with that. Okay, that's pretty good. Pretty good. Okay, I'm just gonna comb it through one more time. Let me discard of this hair. Try to keep all those pieces. Oh yeah, that feels so much more manageable. Oh yeah. Mm. 
that's just so much better. All right, so I'm gonna put the uh, hair tie back on my hair and tie it back. And my mask is slipping. Let me fix it real quick. Okay, see it feels thicker, you know, when, when you get it cut. And it, it's just way more manageable. So I still have a long ponytail. People that, you know, hang around me every day, they might notice the difference. But if you haven't seen me in a while, you, you know, and you look at me, it wouldn't be that much of a change. Even though it was quite a bit of hair, it was like probably four or five inches. Here's a good piece. Let me just pull it out and show you. I mean, quite a long piece of hair. At least four inches. So, very good. Okay, y'all, I'm going to tell you just a little bit more about this mask, and then we're going to take it off. It's a 15-20 minute mask. It has uh, Shanomelis Senesis Fruit Extract, was an, which is an antioxidant rich ingredient that helps hydrate and soothe the skin. And then it has Lemon Fruit Extract, which is an ingredient packed with vitamin C to help promote a brighter complexion. So, it, I mean, it's fun to wear, you know, because it's all shiny and gold and, you know, you feel kind of like a robot or a tin man of sorts, you know, but the vitamin C in it is just amazing. And when I wore this last Sunday night, I came into the live stream with circles underneath my eyes. And then when I took the mask off, they were gone and it was amazing. And so anyway, last night I did not sleep well at all. In fact, I'm probably going to have to take a nap today. <coughs> excuse me, which is fine. You know, I've got time. I can take a nap and uh, I've got some things I got to get done though, but I still, you know, I can take time to take a nap anyway. Okay. Let's take this off and whoo, it's done. It's magic. And we're just going to rub this in. And just like that, I got a good vitamin C treatment and a haircut all in one sitting and I was overdue for the haircut I probably should have cut it a couple months ago oh that felt good okay all right that's from face three y'all um, they have the best masks and there's still some essence in there so I'm gonna let it sit right here and I'm going to use it and you know as the serum up over the course of the next couple of days and if you're having problems with uh, dark circles underneath your eyes puffiness bags uh, vitamin C and caffeine those are like and of course hydration those are like the main things that you need for your under eye area to help you along but a nap will help too <laughs> which I desperately need one today no headband today, y'all, since I gave myself a haircut, but I hope y'all are having a great day. Be sure to check out Chelsea's uh, video. Down below is the link, and we do appreciate your support very much. And this is Mr. Fantastic, my thumbs up ink pen, and we say thank you very much. All right, you guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider doing so before you leave, and God bless you today is my prayer. I will see you in my next video. Bye.